of the plane from the Garden State of New Jersey is the uh, investigative journalist provocateur, a.k.a. James O'Keefe. Thank you. So, um, I'm going to start off by showing everyone some videos. Because um, that's what I do. And many people have uh, actually talked about the Acorn videos, talked about the corruption that was exposed at Acorn, um, but most people haven't actually seen the Acorn videos because the media wouldn't show them to you, it's been a while. Um, but most people haven't seen the actual substance of what the employees say, and I always want to emphasize what the people actually say inside these offices, because that's really what, what it comes down to, that's what, what the stories are all about. So before I, I, um, I talk more about that and some of the other videos that we've done, uh, I'm actually gonna have someone just show you the acorn tapes. What better person to show you the acorn tapes than John Stewart? who did an extremely, I believe, fair, uh, equitable job of, of showing those tapes. Um, and then we're going to show you some other stuff, show you Christian's music video, um, and some reactions to that. Uh, but first, I'm going to take you on a journey through some of what we've done over the last two and a half years. And let's start with John Stewart talking about the Acorn videos in September of 2009. Go ahead and play that tape and turn the audio up. <laughs> by this hidden camera investigation of an unlikely duo looking for tax help. Scenario, a young woman pretending to be a prostitute and a man pretending to run for Congress one day walk into Acorn's Baltimore.